Alrighty, I am at a Target right now, and they've got two Legacy Bulkheads. I actually ordered him online though. And they've got the Legacy Silver Streak, who I also ordered online. Um, they got the Joker Titan, the Red Hood, Black Suit, suit Superman. Um, Marvel Legends, they've got this thing, and I see they got a Moro. Um, those are all old, nothing new. Star Wars section, I got a Bo Katan, Q90, and just a couple of Landos there. Yeah, that's pretty much it. We also have the Thor Love and Thunder set here early. I don't see the other one, unfortunately. I wonder if it's going to be street dated. Um, it's only 20 bucks, so I'll probably pick it up. I wasn't going to pick this one up, but whatever. Might as well, because it's here. Wish they had the other one. So the Thor set is street dated, so they are not going to let me buy it. Iron Man. I am now at a Walmart, so we're gonna see if there's anything worth buying here. I'm gonna see if they have that exclusive version of the No Way Home case. Um, I don't have the movie yet, so we'll see. Coming to the electronic section first, you can see um, they just had the DVD and that no, none of the exclusive or even the regular 4K, which is disappointing. They do have a Batman and cat, and, but it's just clothes. All right, we're in the regular toy aisle now. I guess I moved everything I actually care about all the way down here. Um, Transformers. Um, I might pick up the sweep. They do have, ooh, they've got knockout. Um, oh, that's tempting. We'll see. And they've got Slug. And they got a star screen. Cores are all regular. Those are just blur. Um, Legends, they do have most of that wave, it seems like. As well as some of those things. Star Wars, they just got Lando, Leia, some more Landos. That's literally all you ever find anymore, though. And DC, they have... Uh, I don't see any of the statues, unfortunately, which I just need that Batman statue. And then I do kind of want just the basic Batman figure, if they would have it. They got Penguin. Um, on there, let's see. Selena Kyle and Catwoman. Yeah, nothing really. Um, so, what do they want for these? Do they just really want twenty four ninety nine for these things? This is TRA action figure twenty four ninety seven. Oh geez, if that's really what they want for these, like I just want it because it's knockout. But they're making, you know what? <sighs> it's tough because they're making the new generations legacy one. I don't know. I'll think about it. Taking a look at the Lego section. Um, they got this new mechs. I don't see the Iron Man mech though, which is odd. Speed Champions. Um, some Rem. Oh, that one's open. Never mind. I was say they have one left, but no, they don't. Um, some random stuff. Some more random stuff. Nothing special. So yeah, I just double checked on their website and the red figures are now twenty four or twenty four ninety seven. As are freaking studio series. These are twenty four ninety seven too, which is kinda crazy because like he has like Blur has been on the shelf at like eight, when they were like eighteen dollars. So I don't know why they think they can raise prices by seventeen freaking or seven dollars that they're gonna sell again. I don't know, it's crazy, but I will not be picking up knockout at that price. Here's their Funko Pop section. They got Walmart exclusive thingy. 
Um, so the Hamilton Pops. Um, I don't think I really need any of those. I did want Eliza if they had her, but I just see. Angelica, yeah, I don't think they're gonna have her. Um, nothing else I really want, honestly. Yeah, nothing. They actually have a whole other section of Funko Pops here. Um, looks like it's Mandalorian and Boba Fett themed. I actually have a Boba Fett pop. Uh, Wenwu, Luke with Grogu, some Fennec Shans, or Hamilton, um, just those same second wave, though. What is up, guys? I just got home for Easter, I guess, so I want to show you part of my haul that I've got since for the couple months that I've been home. So, just so you can see, it's been a couple months since I've been home, and I have a ridiculous number of boxes and packages to open. So let's open these up and see what's inside. Cause there are. All right guys, I think I got everything in all those boxes laid out. So let's take a look at everything. So first up, I got this Clone Wars wave of vintage collection. Um, the only one I'm missing is the Ark Trooper, which I wonder if they, should, they do not show on the back, which I actually ordered from Walmart. But you can see, they literally sent me cop drops instead of the art trooper so that is very annoying also i got in the dark saber which is amazing i'm so excited to open that up now coming over here this is this is the crazy part all of this stuff oh my gosh uh so i actually just started buying some lego ninjago stuff so you can see i've got literally so many sets um pretty much all the new legacy sets crazy um, some minifig packs. Coming over here, we got some Transformers. A lot of the new Legacy stuff. Uh, I've got a bunch of Lego books from Target because they were super cheap. I got that Grand Admiral Thrawn mini bust. Some more Ninjago. And then some cheap on um, those two mechs. I was able to get the Wolverine mech already, so I got those two. Uh, some Micro Fighters because they were on sale. Five more of the Clone Pack. I got that sunflower set for my friend. That little Shang-Chi battle pack. Yeah, absolutely not. So I'm not gonna go um, everything one by one, but yeah, it's a lot. And then these I'm, I'm going to eventually organize, but I literally just ordered a lot of stuff from Bricklink. So yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. So yeah. Anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this toy hunt slash haul video. Um, I'll try to get another video up soon, but yeah, please consider subscribing and leaving a like and have a great day.